Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you're running Windows 11 24H2, then just a quick video to let you know that you are now able to download the JPEG Excel image extension for 24H2. So if you are downloading a lot of images or dealing with a lot of images on a day-to-day -day basis, this may be a step in the right direction. Now, what the JPEG XL offers over the standard JPEG is apparently it's got better web compatibility than JPEG. And some other benefits are better compression. It supports lossless and lossy compression. Uh, it supports uh, transparency. It also supports HDR and a wide range of colors. Um, and that's just to mention a couple of the benefits that it has kind of over the standard JPEG format. So how you can get the JPEG Excel extension is you can download it from the Microsoft Store. It's a relatively free image format. And you just do a search for JPEG or JPEG XL and it'll bring you to the relevant page. And now you can see, you can click on Get and that'll download and install that onto your 24H2 system. And just take note though that the image extension JPEG XL is only compatible with Windows 11 version 24H2. If you try to run it on other versions of Windows, even 23H2, um, you're going to run into problems and it might fail um, with an error and so on. So at this stage, currently only available for 24H2. And something else just to take note of is if we just head down to the description, it says... The extension is not an app. You cannot interact directly with it. It installs a plugin used by Windows apps such as File Explorer to decode JPEG Excel images. Please use File Explorer to view thumbnails after installing the extension. So um, just take note of that. Um, you're not going to see a physical app on your system. So what this means now is that if you are running 24H2, you won't need to have to download any third-party software now. It'll just open that format natively now within file explorer on version 24h2 which i think is a step in the right direction so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one